Now, listen, it is official. Usher will be headlining the 2024 Super Bowl halftime show presented by Apple Music. The singer released the following statement saying, and I quote, it's an honor of a lifetime to finally check a Super Bowl performance off my bucket list. I can't wait to bring the world a show unlike anything else they've seen from me before. Not funky. Are y'all excited to see Usher at the Super Bowl stage? You know what, Madison and Al, I am super excited to see Usher on this stage. At the last couple Super Bowl reunion things, you know, people left a little unsatisfied and they kept throwing out names of people who would be great. Oh, this person would be great. And when they threw Usher in, I'm not going to lie to you, I was one of the first people to argue, did he have enough commercial hits to, to maintain a whole Super Bowl thing by himself? Well, needless to say, how his residency has been selling out in Vegas and the way y'all girls been going down there spending up all y'all rent money on them Vegas tickets. And the way he just added a November and a December show to the Vegas thing, so I might have to make my way down there. I am most definitely excited to see Usher hosting the Super Bowl Bowl. I eat my words and regret the fact that I ever questioned his catalog's ability to do so. And I hope that Jay-Z and them pull out all the money so he can have all the stops pulled out. And this is not pitting them against each other so we can get a little more than we got from Rihanna. I'm just saying. <laughs> Oh, well, that's interesting, Q, because I was thinking one of his biggest hurdles is that he's got to get over that 120 many million viewers, which is the largest viewership any Super Bowl halftime has ever had. And that was only done by Miss Rihanna. Now, you have a right to question his his catalog, but we like you said, we can't rush. We can't question the fact that he has been doing phenomenal at his Vegas re residency. That makes that that makes it so that he has a relationship with Vegas. It's appropriate for him to do it because of that residency and his relationship. He's a great performer. He sold over eight, what 100 million uh, records real, real, worldwide. He has eight Grammys. He has nine Billboard Hot one you know 100 top number one hits and he's been in the business for three decades so i think definitely he is the one to choose to pick to see if he can outdo rihanna baby uh, long as kiki palmer down there with her net dress on oh i'm down there to the super bowl watching it with my own eye and it's so funny that you say that madison because butterfly j hart said usher bet not bring kiki out to perform that hit <laughs> they made we got a few other comments um, Blue Skits, Skits Sophisticated says, I don't care nothing about that game, but will be watching Usher. And Hot Commodity 77 says, I think he will do a great job and we need party hits coming from the Super Bowl. I couldn't agree more. Child, that's the only man that can still serenade me out of my panties. <laughs> every, other, every other man in the U.S. already has. Uh, it's okay. He rich enough to do it. Hush your mouth. <laughs> Listen, y'all, hush, hush. 